Just for a start of the vid, the first comment on this video is going to get themselves a free mystery box, so congratulations to have won those. But for the other five mystery boxes, I'm going to be giving them away to five random comments. So to enter that giveaway, all you have to do is just like the video, be subscribed to my channel with notifications on, comment your game name on iCov, and finally join my Discord using the link in the description below. And that's pretty much all you have to do to enter. So good luck on that giveaway. Also, guys, I'm currently offering infernal services for people, as you can see on this thread, which I will link in the description below. So as you can see, I only charge 300 more for a regular infernal cape and full bill for a max infernal cape and all the details and requirements can be found on this forum thread so if you're interested in having an infernal cape done on your account then feel free to message me on discord and check out this thread the link to my discord can also be found in the description below so check that out Alright, so we actually just got a first perspective piece after using quite a bit of Stardust, so that's another achievement off the list. <laughs> oh shit, we just got another perspective piece as well, nice. One of the achievements is to create a bubble hat, so there it is. Guys, we actually just got a giant scroll pet from Training Agility, so that's another skill pet on the account. That's our third one actually, so not bad, I'll take it. <laughs> Are you actually kidding me? From our first kill of next, we got a verse piece. <laughs> What the fuck? Dude, no way. Holy shit. That's another achievement as well. Put a red drop. That's announced. Holy shit. All right, boys. So we're about to get the achievement to chop 500 logs. And there it is. So that actually did take quite a while, but managed to get out of the way. So hopefully we've got enough bird's nest because another achievement is to search 50 bird's nest. So hopefully I have enough. All right, there we go. Earn one ball GP while acting. Achievement done. Boys, we actually got the onyx. That took so long, but we actually got it. <laughs> Hell yes, dude. Oh my God. This is the content I'm talking about. Freaking onyx. Let's Let's go boys, let's go. Okay, so I just got another Rocky. I'll try to uh, thieve a rune off from this for the achievement, but that's our second Rocky found on the account. <laughs> I'll take it, dude. All right, there we go. Finally, it took us some time, but we managed to steal the rune ore as well. So that's an elite achievement done, which is awesome. Holy shit, we just got Zarite Bow from, oh my God. No way, that's actually like 110 mil. <laughs> We just got the achievement to find a dragon chain bunny. Damn, another achievement done, nice. All right, so we just completed two achievements in one, defeat the Abyssal Sire and defeat it in under three minutes, which is pretty nice, so. All right, that should be the last Abyssal Sire kill. So there we go, defeat Abyssal Sire 35 times. Damn, that took a while, but it's finally done. So I'm pretty happy about that. And um, unfortunately, we didn't actually get any drops in those 35 kills, but yeah, at least we never had to do Sire again. All right, we just got an achievement to defeat Cerberus. So we have to actually kill Cerberus 50 times for the elite achievement. And we've currently got a Slayer task to beat other 29 of them, so might as well do the Slayer task. All right, we managed to beat Cerberus in under two minutes. Nice. Guys, there's currently 127 people at Pest Control. What the hell? We're basically going to be going for the achievement to complete 100 games of Pest Control, so that's probably going to take a while, but it's currently double Pest Control points, and damn, there's a lot of people here. All right, nice. So we just got the achievement to complete 50 laps of the Barbarian Agility course, but to get an Agile piece, we actually need to complete 100 laps of this damn course, so we've got another 50 to go. Feels bad man. All right, we have finally completed 100 laps of the Barbarian GT course, as you can see, so we should be able to speak to this guy and... I'll take the Agile top, to be honest. And there we go, buy a piece of Agile. Finally, that looks damn sexy. All right, I think I'm probably gonna do the Gnome course for the rest of my Marks of Grace since that also gives us agility tickets. And um, yeah, they're pretty OP. So yeah, we do have to actually recolor all six graceful pieces for an achievement, as you can see right there. So we're gonna need a lot more Marks of Grace. Because we're an Uber account, we actually get six agility arena tickets per run, which is really overpowered because like each of these are worth around 500k each. That's like three mil a run. So yeah, that is really good money. So after this grind, we should also be making making like a lot of money from that which should be awesome but graceful legs and i think we've already got the gloves as well let me go grab them we've already got the gloves and recolor them to gold so all we need is the boots the cape and the helm to go and then we need to recolor all five pieces as well all right nice so i just got my first soul wars win which actually gives an achievement to participate in a soul wars game and as achievement to win five soul wars games yeah we need to win another four more but that one actually went really well yeah that's two achievements done all right guys we just got the achievement to participate in five soul wars games so i think that's all the soul wars we actually need to do on the account another achievement is off the list Alright guys, so we're actually going to be opening 91 vote tickets to get the achievement to vote 100 times, so this should be some interesting loot. Let's see what we actually pull out. Archer's Ring Eye. Alright, not bad. A lot of silly jester pieces. A lot of lamps, to be honest. Alright, let's just use all these lamps. Nothing too special, though. Each of them gives a guaranteed one more cash, which is nice. But yeah, they do have, like, a slim chance to get some really rare rewards, but currently we haven't really got anything. Anything good? Come on. Oh, we got a lizard skull. <laughs> um... 
I mean, it came up on the game chat, so I'm guessing that's kind of rare. Right, nothing too special, unfortunately. There we go, we got the achievement to vote 100 times, nice. Currently on an elite Slayer task, and we just got the achievement to defeat next 15 times, so we still have another 6 left in the task, and I'm not sure if we have actually got all the ancient pages, because for completion escape, we do actually have to fill the ancient book with all four ancient pages, which we get as drops from next, so I'm going to check the bank after this trip, and hopefully we do, otherwise we're going to have to keep killing these. Alright boys, that's another achievement done, I think that's an elite one actually, so heal 50,000 hit points while killing next, so another achievement off the list, 137 down. Alright nice, so we actually got a Kraken task as part of our Elite Slayer task, and we just got two achievements at once, defeat the Kraken and beat the Kraken in under 235 minutes, which is nice, so we still got another 33 Krakens left on the task, damn that is a long task. Alright guys, so we actually got a draw from our um, Kraken task, we got a Kraken tentacle, I'm not sure how many that goes for right now, but still another 11 kills to go and that got added to the collection log, yeah nice, <laughs> it's not a trident, but it's a drop, I'll take it. Dude, we just got another Kraken tentacle, what, that was literally like a few kills apart. No way, dude. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Let's go. Damn, alright, we just got our first effigy on the account, which gives a lot of XP, basically. But I'm going to save that until double XP weekend. I'm not going to use it at the moment. We need to get 10 in total for an achievement. That's going to take a while, but that's our first one on the account. Nice. Alright, nice. So we've been killing Bandos, so I think we got assigned like 17. So we just finished bearing 15 Org Bones. So that's another achievement done. So far, we've got two Bandos pages, and we also got Bandos Gloves as a rare drop. Not sure how rare that is. I'll check after the task, but yeah, not really any good drops so far. Alright, nice. We just finished the task, and we got a Bandos War Shield and a God Sword Shard, too. So two drops in one, nice. But yeah, that's the end of the task. Damn, so we actually got two really rare drops. Bandos War Shield was like 1 in 246 and Bandos Gloves were 1 in 273. We could have got the Bandos Helmet, Tassus, Chest Play, or the Pet. Okay, so we just got another next task and on our first kill back, we got a pair of Vertus Gloves. What the hell, dude? Why are we getting such trash drops, man? Alright guys, so I did actually die in next, but I'm gonna repair my opponents, which actually should be achievement, so there we go. Repair a piece of next armor. Only cost us 50 mil. Alright, we just got an achievement to enter the Theatre of Blood, so we're gonna be doing our first attempt with Mr. Dwings and Mr. Goofy. <laughs> Alright, we just did the first room of Theatre of Blood, so we got the achievement to defeat the mid. Alright, we just got the achievement to survive through all the Nyla cast waves. Alright, so we just got two achievements to use the Dawnbringer special attack and hit 700 plus with magic, which is nice. Alright, nice. We just got the achievement to defeat the Pestilent Boat. So that's like all the raised two achievements done. <laughs> and yeah, we did actually die last time, but hopefully we get a drop this time. Wait, I actually think that's the last drop that we need. We just got an ancient page one, and yeah, that's the end of my trip, so let's check. Alright, moment of truth. Yes, boys, we've completed the next book. <sighs> Oh my god, let's go. Alright, nice. But we only have like two kills left on our task, so might as well do that. But we've actually completed our next book. Nice. Oh, damn. On the last kill of the task, we actually got an Armadale Buckler. Alright, I'll take that. Other than like Odium Ward and Twisted Buckler, that's really good for like offhand for range, I'm guessing, if you're not using a Divine. But I'm going to be using Divine most of the time. But yeah, we actually got the achievement to complete 10 Elite Slayer tasks, which is really nice. Alright, we just got the achievement to fish 300 Karamwans. So that's another achievement off the list. Nice. Alright, we just finished the achievement to catch 200 Ducks crabs as you can see so you actually just need a lobster pot to catch them which is pretty easy so that's another achievement done all right i think there's an achievement literally just to smith a rune skimitar oh there it is all right nice all right this should be another achievement out of the way to make 10 overloads so yeah it was a struggle getting all the ingredients but there we go all right i believe another achievement is to craft 50 plus nature runes simultaneously which we've just done there all right that was pretty easy we just got the what the hell we just got a dragon to each sword how rare is that what it's not even on the drop table but yeah pet curse elemental is the rarest thing you can get but d2h i'll take it all right so for my next achievement which is to craft 20 red leather chaps uh, no one's actually selling red dragon hide there's not really any reason to camp it so we had to kill like 40 red dragons ourselves because we need 40 d hides in total so yeah this is our second inventory and we actually got an ungale ticket as well which is used to kill vorkats so that'll be useful in the future i'm guessing <laughs> let's go tan these leathers first of all and then turn them into chaps 20 red leather chaps is done so i'm probably gonna try to get a dark bow next so to actually get a dark bow you need to kill dark beasts which requires Require like 92 Slayer, I think. I'm not sure exactly, but oh, it's only 1 in 39, so hopefully that shouldn't take too long to get. Alright, there we go. So we got it around on the drop rate. 37 kill count required to get it. Not bad. We just teleported with a spirit kaya. Didn't take us into wilderness. Nice. Alright, damn. That took a really long time, but we finally managed to complete play 100 games of pest control. And because we're an Uber rank, we get like 20 points a game or something, I think. So we ended up with 1920 points, but we already have like full elite void, so I'm not really sure what else I need from this shop, so I'm just gonna 
gonna keep the points for now and see if they add anything else to the store that I could spend it on but yeah another achievement done all right so we got all the materials to build a gilded altar which is another achievement so there we go all right we just got a pair of dragon boots on only seven kill counts so that's another achievement done anyway guys I hope you enjoyed that video so yeah we're getting a lot of progress done we're getting closer and closer to complete escape and yeah I can't wait until I finally get it it should be really exciting but if you're enjoying the series make sure to leave a like on the video that would mean a lot to me and make sure to try Icov guys because it's like 2 p.m on a Wednesday and there's 700 plus online and on weekends they have usually over 1500 players online so it is a really active service if you haven't tried it already the link to Icov is in the description below so come try it out and yeah if you do need an infernal cape done like I said at the start of the video message me on discord and I'll be happy to do it for you so and now I'm actually gonna pick the giveaway results from the previous video so good luck to everyone all right so I was giving away five mystery boxes in my last video so the first winner is Flage 2 the second winner is Ruffle Boink Gang the fourth winner is Firefighter and the fifth and final winner goes to wait Boink Gang again all right re-roll that <laughs> Alright, Vice Salmon. So those are our five winners. So to claim your mystery box, just message me on Discord. The link to my Discord can be found in the description below. There's over like 1,300 members in there. And I do loads of giveaways in there as well. So yeah, definitely make sure to check that out. And yeah, thanks for watching, guys.